from the skies to the rails, new at five, a major investment could mean big changes for Metro riders. Battery powered trains like these are coming to Chicago. CBS 2 Sarah Maki reports it's all thanks to a nearly $170 million grant. Watching as the 1244 Metro train rolls up to his platform in Beverly. Yeah, it should be it. Max Milovicus says he wasn't aware there could soon be some changes to his service. No, you're the first one, Sarah. Yeah, you're the first one to tell me about this. Metra is looking to replace some of their existing diesel locomotives with the zero emission battery powered options popping up in Europe and Australia. We would be among the first in North America to have something like this. This, as California tries out zero emission hydrogen passenger trains, Metro spokesperson Michael Gillis says the smaller, clean vehicles would be used at off-peak times, adapting to changing customer habits. Yeah, it, it certainly uh, was something that was accelerated by COVID. We were seeing uh, sort of a, a, a work-from-home pattern develop before that happened, but certainly it rapidly accelerated under COVID. So we know we need to be different. We have to think differently. Metro officials say they would like to use these new trains on the Rock Island line, specifically what's called the Beverly Branch, where they have a high number of stops in a short distance. Meaning Max Milovicus might soon have more options when he needs them most. Oh, yeah, I have an exam today. In Beverly, Sarah Maki, CBS 2 News. Sarah, thank you. Metra does not have a manufacturer lined up, and officials say they don't know when you could expect to see them on the tracks. They also said there's no word yet on how the trains could affect ticket prices.